Hi, uh, my name is Sangeeta and I am an ovarian cancer patient. I was diagnosed in the year 2011 with third stage ovarian cancer which had spread to my uterus, appendix, rectum and omentum. Uh, I've had uh, two rounds of surgery and two rounds of chemotherapy and uh, you know having gone through this ordeal over a period of four years all I can say is that uh, right now I am taking undertaking my treatment with Dr. Dhaniram Barua and I would like to say to people who are suffering from cancer that you should never give up on hope you know never give up on hope like oh my god I have a third stage cancer or even for that matter first second third fourth it's just a number one two three four is just a number it all depends on your determination your willpower to overcome overcome this disease and uh, currently I'm undergoing my treatment with Dr. Dhaniram Barua and I'm 100% sure that I will overcome it like I've overcome it in the past twice and this time for sure I wouldn't want the cancer to uh, come back again and uh, this is what I would like to say to all the cancer patients uh, who are around and not fear and uh, try a lot of things give chemo and radiation and surgery your last option try other things do not fear that oh my god doctors given me a death sentence oh i'm going to die in two weeks doctors told me oh you have only three months to live so you're going to die in three months no it's not like that doctor is not a god he's only here to help you so uh, i would urge all the cancer patients to take the matters in their own hand do a lot of research there's Dr. Dhaniram Barua in Guwahati SM. You can come to him. There are other kinds of things. But never lose on hope and keep trying till you succeed. So I'm sure that, uh, you know, patients, uh, you will be able to overcome the disease. How did the world have changed your, uh, your perception? Like, you, have, you are so well now, you have spoken to yourself. Yeah, uh, when I came to Dr. Barua, this was my third time when I was diagnosed with cancer in the last four years. When I came to him, I was definitely having disease in my abdomen and pelvis. I was unable to walk also freely and there was kind of swelling where it was indicating that my tumor was growing really fast. So I did not have much time. So when I came to him, he clearly gave me three-pronged approach. He told me that it's, a, it's going to be a long-term treatment. I'm not going to give you a genie kind of a medicine. And, you know, I just inject some medicine into it and woof, the uh, cancer just goes away. So he clearly said that the first aim would be stopping the spread of cancer. The second aim would be uh, to make my body and the immunity system much more stronger. Once the immune system is strong, with the help of Sir's medicine, which is the biological weapons which he has against cancer, it will help in uh, reducing the uh, reducing or killing the cancer cells. The immune system plays a big role in uh, the killing of cancer cells. I mean, the immune system, I would say, is a God's creation or a God's chemo or whatever we have in our body. So clearly, he was able to stop the spread of cancer initially. Uh, in a period of one month or so when I was taking the treatment the cancer the spreading has been considerably stopped to quite an extent then my immunity system has definitely increased I feel much more hungry I feel much more energetic and I am able to do walks and I am able to do a lot of pranayam during the day and thirdly yes there is definitely been a size uh, because my immunity system is better and sir's medicine is working so there's definitely been a reduction in the tumor size which has been, say, slowly but steadily, but it's there has been quite a reduction in the tumor size. So that's what it is. Thank you. A good counseling by Dr. Daniram, especially as far as the diet concerned. He has asked us to stop all the animal proteins, thereby all the non-veg is totally bad. And milk and dairy products are not at all good for the body, even for a normal person. They don't help, especially in cancer patients. So he has asked us to take maximum vegetables. Vegetables have got each and every nutrient what body is required. Whether it is for immunity, your immunity system also will increase with the help of taking the right kind of certain things. So we are following strictly last two, three months and we are finding the benefits of it. Earlier we were eating a lot of non a lot of milk products, milk pio, it doesn't work. So see, you have to understand the cancer cells, how they